a guy out of Dallas. At the ninth with him. And just a yard closer. Abbreviated follow through once again. You seeing anything short here on nine? Sung Jay, dare I say, now oh, Sung Jay made all pars, no birdies, no bogeys. Hit seven greens, but was pretty dissatisfied with his ball striking. Here's another green, and he'll probably go ahead and take a par if you'll give it to him. 28 feet for birdie. Watch how long it takes this ball to get to the hole. Look, what is that practice stroke is going to knock in the bunker. And that looked good the entire way. And for Eagle, we couldn't see on screen what was going on on that second shot. Where is he? Well, he's about uh, three feet onto the green, which means he's about 89 feet from the hole. A good estimate, 93 is what we're seeing, John. Well, uh, the pin sheet says that the flag is 90 feet from the front edge, and he's on the green. So somebody's lying to you. I don't know who. Could be me. Could be them. Maybe it's an angle thing, John. Either who knows? Either way, it's a long it putt for Eagle. An angle. It is a very long putt for Eagle, one you would not expect to make. But you'll take a two putt, and for a guy that's made 10 pars to start his day, this is likely his best chance. This goes through the contours of the green, down through a valley, up to the hole. Full turn required. What are you giving a good putt here, John? Inside five feet, six feet? I, th I think inside Scotty Scheffler's a good putt. I think that if he can get it to where Scotty putts before him, he's done well. And that's actually, as a player, how I would have thought about it. That's better than okay. A little bit of a deeper chip than Scotty Scheffler. Sung JM on the tee at 12. Beautiful here, up the right center of the fairway. Sung JM the run. He's got a little ridge he has to either Landed on top of or carry over with a little spin. About the first 15, 16 feet of this. And he popped it right over it. Easy. Well, intensity that is a little bit higher than most. And I think it's just a matter of which one suits your personality best. Two good putts right there from right here today. This front left, it just, you stand there and it's begging you to hit right at it. Just seems always difficult to get the right club or right yardage. Sung Jay now to play. And it's dead, it's dead flat, John. I mean, there's not like you get fooled by the hill or, or anything. It's just 
I agree with you. You're trying to be so careful with the shot and so precise with it that the inevitable is it slows down. Hey, it's paid off for Scotty Scheffler. Now Sun J M. The Sun J have the Sun J have Randy's number. Uh, I don't know if he's got his number, but I'm happy to send it to you, and you can give it to him. <laughs> well, that was a much better pass right there. Stayed behind that one and fired through. And that would not be a bad play. Carried about halfway. It all sort of bleeds from left to right up there on the green. Looks like it needed a little more gas. Move the minute. Yeah. Now on the fifteenth. And that is a quick hook left. Well, a huge break that his ball ended up here after rattling around in the trees some 30 yards to his left. It's not a great lie, but as you heard Bobby say, just 106 yards. He's looking 10 feet right of the flag. Big two putt right here because he has his challenges on the way in. This is, is going to get fast at the hole. Oh, he just hammered that. Easy. Easy. I mean, uh, as soon as he made contact with that first putt, I was asking for it to slow down. But this is uphill, and this is quite makeable. It's solid positive stroke, but that's a bogey. It was a snap hook, a mediocre wedge shot. Jay. Uh, that started out just at the edge of the swamp and faded back to the middle of the fairway. There's a guy who knows it's now or never. Just right of the green. Not a good lie, just wants to pop it just onto the fringe. Get it over the rough and let it track down to the hole. Yeah. Left. Yeah, it's, we, we, this is not the first time that the broadcaster and the player have completely misread the screen. You would think that having been here before and seeing one that went the wrong way, I would have remembered, but I didn't. I had a Champions Tour moment, I guess. A good save there. Uh, hounding their every move at the golf course. That's a very good point.
Sunjay needs a three. We have a guy that needs a birdie on one of the last two holes, and I'd say that this one is a far <coughs> easier three than the last one. He's off to a good start. Again. Yeah, he's not bailing this thing out to the right, I promise you. Trying to take dead aim. How's this distance? Awfully okay. good. Positive thoughts about Sun JM. <laughs> We don't wish bad amongst an, on another player. We certainly want him to make the cut too. It's just like, hey, Sungjae, throw us a bone. Give us a chance to play as well. No, I'd be thinking bad thoughts about it. Oh, but I'm not now. Now he's your best friend. <laughs> I mean, I. I, I I'm really surprised he missed that putt, to be honest with you. He hasn't put it well today, hasn't had it. So, John, if you were in this situation and you were watching at home, would you be looking at this? If you're Sanjay now, the mindset changes a little bit. Now you're hoping two under is good enough because you know how unlikely a three is here. Get it on the green in two and make sure you make your four and hope that's good enough. Our director thinks it's good enough. Yes. There are some who are of the opinion that two under is safe. And he will have a tea time come Saturday and Sunday at the Country Club of Jackson. What a birdie on the last hole for me.